So we now know that if England are successful tomorrow, they'll face Switzerland next Saturday in the last eight. But they'll have to get past Slovakia first, something not every fan will be confident of following a lacklustre campaign so far. Our sports editor Steve Scott reports from Germany. All 26 Lions were prowling today, but despite Gareth Southgate having a full squad, minus Luke Shaw, to choose from, as a national leader in election week appropriately, it seems the man is not for turning. That means Cole Palmer, Anthony Gordon and others will have to stay patient for their chance to shine. You've got to be very careful not to throw everything out the window and lose things that you're doing well and lose continuity and um, the confidence that comes from players playing together and the understanding that comes from those moments. It's been a difficult week for Southgate and his team. You sense the love affair is turning sour, but they all know one good performance changes everything. 99% of the fans are behind the team and the manager, I think, of course. Um, both as a player and as a coach, you're going to have times where people uh, voice their opinion and that's part and parcel of playing for England. Fans just want to believe the undoubted talent is about to explode into life. Southgate have been slated for saying it's tournament football, but, but it is. You know, we've, we've done what we need to do. We won the group. We're on the easy side of the draw. I think we'll get a good result tomorrow and carry on through and win it. <laughs> Come on, the boys! <laughs> Slovakia may well be ranked 40 places lower than England, but that's still much higher than Slovenia, who the three Lions struggle to tame in their last group game. What's more, they've already taken the considerable scalp of Belgium. It will not be a straightforward evening here. The Slovakians have already said, despite the fact they've never beaten England before, now is the perfect time to change that. If Southgate's team doesn't click soon, then the dream to lay a certain date to rest will continue for another couple of years, at least. Steve Scott, ITV News, Gelsenkirchen.